daily chatter about bubbles bursting, inflation, and shrinking budgets, there's one thing we can count on blowing up. Chewing gum. Whenever I play in soccer or whatever, I like to chew it in and keep me focused and take the anxiety away. Now surgeons are finding another somewhat novel use for gum. It may help speed recovery after surgery involving the stomach, gallbladder, colon, or liver. The problem with this uh, intestinal surgery is when you put the patient to sleep, even the intestine goes to sleep. The patient wakes up, but the intestine stays asleep. So uh, we are trying everything to make sure that the intestine is back to normal function before we send the patient home. Doctors wait for a patient to have a bowel movement to make sure their intestines are working properly. That could take days following a major surgery. The theory is chewing gum can shift your body back into drive. I think a stimulation in the mouth may be the reason of the intestine to start functioning again. The period of time after abdominal surgery, when the GI system is stagnant, is called ileus. Researchers actually tested to see if this window is shortened when a patient chews gum, and found in many cases it is. Any way to decrease that ileus would be good, and uh, chewing gum is good because it doesn't have any complication. If you find something that is soft, no complication, why not, and it's cheap. There are no protocols about type, amount, or frequency of gum use, but it's long been used as a snappy substitute for food. If you're chewing all the time, you won't really be thinking about eating food or munching on snacks or anything once you have something already in your mouth. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.